Okay y'all, so I was trying to eat my dinner and I saw this story about this little boy named Joshua and it was on the news. I'm in Atlanta, Georgia. Um, Joshua, he suffers from sickle cell. Um, sickle cell is uh, the like the same disease that uh, T Von suffered from from the group TLC. Joshua needs a donor, uh, somebody to uh, donate him bone marrow. Uh, he's been sickly and in and out of the hospital since he was 18 months old and now he is 14. Um, and I just had to get up from the table like I couldn't even um, eat my food yet finish eating my food because y'all know I have a little boy I have a, a son and children they just touch my heart and anytime uh, I see a child suffering it just It just breaks my heart, and I wish that there was something that that I could do. Um, I heard that it um, that it hurts to donate bone marrow or to get the transplant. One of them hurts a lot, but. Um, if there's anybody out there who could try to help this young man and his mother, um, the story was on the news uh, just now, Atlanta, Georgia. He's 14 years old. His name is Joshua, and he needs a bone marrow transplant. You know, uh, and maybe somebody may actually be a match, um, and it might help save his life. So, I just wanted to share that story with y'all, and I'm gonna go back and eat my dinner. But uh, it really brought me to tears. So, um. I know it's not much, it may not come to anything, but um, I just decided to use my platform and just ask anybody out there um, if you would be willing to um, donate, then you have to see first if you're a match. Um, but uh, to Joshua's mother, if you end up seeing this video, my prayers go out to you and to you, Joshua. My prayers go out to you that you being strong and keep praying to God that he get you a donor and that somebody can help you um, get what you need from the doctors. Okay, I'd like to introduce you all to Joshua. This is Joshua, and Joshua has been very, 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 very strong. Joshua's story is on Fox 5 Atlanta. You can go to fox5atlanta.com, or you can Google bone marrow Joshua, and his story will pop up. That would probably be the fastest way to find his story, because that's how I found his story. Joshua suffers from sickle cell and he has had to be very strong his entire life. Every month he's been getting a blood transfusion and we need more African American people who can go out and donate bone marrow to try to help children like Joshua. Here's an athlete who has taken it upon himself to advocate for Joshua 
in and without the community to go and see if he can find donors for Joshua. And I applaud him for this in the black community. And we really need people to go to the Be The Match registry and you can get swabbed on April 27th from 4.30 p.m. to 7 p.m. at Maynard Jackson Jackson High School in Joshua's honor. Or you can join bethematch.org slash save Joshua. Here is a picture of a small child. And with the bone marrow transplant, they have to go to the bone and do the testing and things like that. Um through the swabbing to see if you're a match here is a clinical manual of blood and bone marrow transplantation that you can find on amazon.com so i did a little bit of digging to find out a little bit more about joshua's story and i found that there is a facebook uh called be the match and it talks about Joshua's story, asking everyone to please show their support. You can join online at bethematch.org slash join. Joshua's story was also featured on ABC News. And Joshua said, please help me find my match. Joshua's family hopes that their son will be able to find a match and live a full life. My dream for Joshua is being healthy, being able to do just what he loves to do. Right now, Joshua feels like he can do anything, and it would bring so much joy to me. It was also on Newsbreak.com, teen searching for bone marrow, donor, donor gets assist from pro athlete. So it talks about Joshua's story a little more, and it's like the same story that was on Fox 5 News. But I was also able to find a little bit more about Joshua's story from when he was two years old. So at Daily Advent, it talks about Joshua's story and him needing to get the help. But this story goes back a long time because Joshua has trying to has been trying to get people to donate to him for a long time at be the match dot com is where you can find information about how to donate but Joshua has been looking for a donor since he was six years old or as far back as when he was six years old and when he was two years old Joshua suffered a stroke and Joshua was left paralyzed in a wheelchair and there was a high probability that he would suffer another stroke if he did not receive the marrow transplant. So July is African American Bone Marrow Month and Joshua his story has been circulating all over the internet and all over the United States for many many years now. So for us to see Joshua in the condition that he is in it means that Joshua is one of the patients that really needs this the most. And his mother and him are photoed here in this photograph. And he is an amazing little boy and he's a normal teenager, but he needs to get healthy so that he can go out and play and have fun. I'm really trying to fight holding back the tears right now and I can't hold them back. I have a son. I'm really advocating for Joshua. His mother has been there by his side and he has grown into a wonderful teenage little boy. I can only imagine how hard this has been for them. They really do need someone to help because this is a child. Joshua has been going through this since he was 18 months old. So that really has to have an effect on his childhood and to see what he has to go through every month just to make sure that he stays in good health. There has to be more that we could do as a community because he's a normal little boy. He should not have to suffer. He is a child 
and he needs his health, there is something that we can do. And that's why if you can sign up today at Be The Match, you have athlete Drew Holiday asking everyone to please, please go online and sign up at Be The Match and help Joshua. He is an amazing teenager and he should not have to go through this. Every single month he is in the hospital and he is fighting for his life. He is a child and he should not have to go through this. He has a mother who loves him dearly and she wants her baby to be okay. So you guys can go to Maynard Jackson High School April 27th between the hours of 4.30 p.m. and 7 o'clock p.m. to see if you can be the match for Joshua and if you can be his hero today. Thank you.